gotta make sure it stays in place. Corey Bowen, I ride BMX bikes. That's my day to day. What are you doing? Doing a fucking interview, mate. What do you think? Oh, oh sorry. Hi. Yeah, sitting in the hot seat, man, talking about you and how you're never going to be a professional water skier. <laughs> I was going to be in Australia for dad's birthday and so my sister's husband Simon, his yeah. friend's got a great boat and he's like, yeah, take the boat out, let's go out. Dad used to barefoot ski when he was younger and he just kills it on the single ski. Dad just owning it at 59, eh? So awesome. Setting the pace right now. Robbo's up next. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! I don't really like Corey Bowen that much at the moment. Fall back? Yeah, you just fall back. He's after fatigue. <laughs> <laughs> That last one, my nuts hit. I was like, oh, yeah. What's going on here? Yeah. It's spotless. It's a giant day. We have some of the most beautiful coastline there is on offer. It's like some of these parks are right on the beach. And so we headed up to Malula Bar. I just wanted to ride this mini ramp that's like got the ocean as its background. It's pretty windy out. Oh shit, we're having nips. School, I didn't know what I wanted to do, you know, so dad had his construction business. I don't know where his apron is now. <laughs> I'd have to go look in the trailer in the cobwebs. That's I don't know if he'll use it though. I used to be working here all week <laughs> thinking about contests and riding and it'd come Friday, Saturday, <laughs> Sunday, have a ball and then Sunday night I'd be like, oh shit. <laughs> it's like, dad, any chance I can get that Monday off? <laughs> that used to be my famous deal, Sunday nights, any chance? <laughs> I was jealous, I always had to go whenever the BMX skills. My brother would be so pissed. Come in the, my room in the mornings and I'd pretend like I wasn't feeling good and shit. He go, you fucking come when I... I was like, nah. First ever time I worked with the Bowens, it was probably, yeah, it was the last time. <laughs> I was 18, full of life, fit. What are we doing today? I thought we might be laying some sheets. No, shoveling concrete. Anyway, Bev demonstrated, he's like, Whoosh! and I was just there. Struggling, they're like, hurry the fuck up, the concrete's gonna dry before you finish your one little one by one area. Never again. Two days later, I still couldn't work or move. So I learned my lesson, I was like, I'm never gonna work that hard ever. Look at me now, I'm flying. <laughs> Good memory, though. But that's all it is now, isn't it? Yeah. Memory. I try to avoid this as much as possible for as long as I can. Knock off time, eh? A bit early, but we'll let you go. <laughs> you know, being at home, we've got to take advantage of the coastline. And growing up as a kid, I surfed all the time. I just remember every Saturday, we'd be like off to the beach, Dad would be with us all day, and I love to surf. <laughs> <laughs> Not going out, bro. Had that water skiing accident the other day. They tore me balls off going through the wake, so. <laughs> okay, man. No worries, eh? Just spoke to Bede. He's going to cruise down and show us how it's done. I'm going to get out there and just drop in on Hixie. Get some lessons off the king, huh? Show us how it's done.
<laughs> it was great to be with family and friends, but I want to be in contest mode, I guess you can say, for one of the best dirt events you're ever going to see, the Red Bull Empire Dirt. This is really close to downtown London and then it's in the park, we've got trees and it's a very different feel to the last one. Big jumps for breakfast or lunch. Might be dinner time, I don't know. Just putting it all together, it's pretty wild, eh? Riders, ready! Hold my dick! Dun -dun -dun. Everyone's like talked about the first, the ski jump thing, because it's like, that's just an opener right there. I mean, the first, that's only 30 foot. See, man, this thing is fucked. This jump will eat your face, man. Everyone's got that mellow, chill vibe, but then like dudes will be firing tricks, dudes will be flowing, like, it's got it all. It's pretty sick. Good group of dudes. This one's sick, dude. That curved wall ride is insane. I've never ridden anything like that. It's pretty rad. It's so unique. So many different obstacles and just stuff I've never seen before. It's scary and pretty sketchy at the same time. But uh, if you combine all that together, it's nothing but good times, so. Two thumbs up. This place is awesome. Red Bull Empire Dirt is like a gnarly contest to be coming back at. It was definitely a little nerve wracking just because it's been a little while. It was a mixture of excitement, scared shitless, and then a bit of a thrill, all mixed in one pot. If you've ever wanted to know what it's like from my ball sack when I'm riding, you get to see the point of view. How's that look? Nice and tight back there? Good. Ball sack camp. Point of view right here, baby. <laughs> Sexy. It's a good look. Next time on Wizard of Oz. Monday makes the night!